Hello guys and welcome to using the WordPress dashboard by WA Courses. In this video, I'm just going to explain how you can use the WordPress dashboard and the functionalities that are available in the WordPress dashboard. So without the way, let's get started. So once you log into your WordPress dashboard, you're going to get um, different functionality. So this is basically separated into two parts. So at the left hand side, you have your um, toolbar so this is this just gives you um, access to different features and the right hand side which is the bigger part shows you the content for that specific section okay so on that dashboard we have home and on that home we have things like um, statistics like uh, site health total number of posts comments pages and over here we have wordpress events and news so if you if you want to attend a WordPress meetup or anything concerning WordPress, uh, you can get that from here, including news. Then over here, you get activity. So whatever article you posted, you're going to get the time you posted it here and your recent comments. Okay. So what this home just gives you access to is just uh, statistics, basic statistics of your website for WordPress installation. On the dashboard, we also have updates. So if you go over to updates, you can do things like update your plugins and update your themes. Okay. So right now we can update um, a few themes here like 2019 and 2021 and all our plugins are up to date. So this second part is just for updating your um, plugins and themes and everything that concerns WordPress. So you can also install the latest version of wordpress from this updates section okay so the dashboard just gives you uh, functionality and allows you to do things like create posts add new pages add new pictures using media uh, allow comments and reply comments change the appearance add extra functionality using plugins um, add new users to your WordPress website. So if you want to have more than one user, more than one person logging into the back end, you can add a new one here. Gives you access to two, so you can export your your files and import new ones. Check things like site health, export your personal data. So there's a lot of stuff here. And over at settings, gives you option to change writing, reading and discussion settings, general settings, media, permalink, and privacy. So that's just the basics of um, the dashboard. It's very easy to use. Each section is very, very uh, user intuitive. So you don't really need to learn much to understand. So if you know how to use posts, you should be able to um, know how to use pages because they're very similar. Media is also very straightforward. It gives you a library just like a normal file manager. And if you click on add new, it gives you an uploader. So everything on the back end of WordPress is very easy. You just need to know how everything works together. Okay. How themes work with plugins, how plugins work with posts and pages and all that. So that's what the entire course is for. And this video uh, should have given you a good idea of how dashboard works. So I'll see you guys in the next video where we talk about the WordPress toolbar.